The doctor told my dad he needed to lose 20 to 30 pounds because he had high blood pressure. He always told us he would start eating better tomorrow, that he would start working out on Monday. Tomorrow never happened. Monday never came. He had a stroke in his brainstem, which is essentially a death sentence. His high blood pressure killed him. Your brainstem controls all of your involuntary bodily functions, your circulatory system, and your respiratory system, among others. He was rushed to the hospital and was immediately admitted into the ICU ward. We arrived at the hospital to see him with a ventilator tube in his mouth to help him breathe. He couldn't talk, but we saw the pain and the fear in his eyes. He knew this was the end. His body was having tremors and his hand was shaking, but somehow he managed to scribble a DNR, a do not resuscitate on a napkin. The doctors tried to give us hope and they let us know that they were doing everything that they could and it looked promising for his recovery. Three days later, my phone rang at 3.30 a.m. It was my sister telling me our father had a second catastrophic stroke and died. He only needed to lose 20 to 30 pounds. His high blood pressure killed him. He was only 56 years young. My dad was my best friend. I'm even named after him. I am so much like him in many ways. I love you, dad, and I miss you every day. I'm also so mad at him that he didn't change his diet and start working out and not being here with us. Dads and moms, if you don't decide to get healthy for yourself, look at your kids and do it for them. I am having this conversation with you for them as a child who misses his father more than I can put into words. You wanted to have a family. Your children didn't ask to be born. It's your responsibility to do whatever is necessary to be here with them, to watch them grow up and guide them as they do. Dads, you don't want another man walking your daughter down the aisle instead of you, do you? Moms, you don't want another woman receiving gifts from your son on Mother's Day, do you? Parents always say, they would die for their children. My question is, will you live for them? Take the first step. You don't need to completely overhaul your lifestyle in a day. Just start with one small strategic change that you feel confident in doing. Eventually, this will lead to another step and another step. And before you know it, you'll be halfway there. Just start. Don't let my dad's story be your story. Just get started right now with what you can do. Do you need a hand to get going? My Limitless Lifestyle online coaching package includes personalized nutrition from a certified sports nutritionist, custom workout plans, weekly check-ins, progress tracking, mindset coaching and accountability, and so much more with direct access to me as your coach.